a short walkthrough of all of the governor parks the way they work one last time before we install them on the engine and this long arm right here was a question the um, a few episodes ago as these marks right here those round circles that is uh, that is from where this when this arm was put on here in that it right in that area there on that flat place and you tighten this up to lock it in okay I counted those that that shoe has been in 17 different places there has been 17 different adjustments on this arm here and the furthest one back there is right there and the furthest one up here and that's a little more than one inch I, I can I for the life of me I cannot see why that would need to be a, adjusted that much because it's in the same plane so it would have nothing to do with speed control it the only thing that this does is put this on put this in a different position and I'll show you but when I when I first put that through there I noticed a little little uh, restriction and if I can show, find it, okay, y'all, y'all, y'all see that little half moon shiny place right there? Okay, that's a high place, and and it's it's too high. So anytime you got a high place, you, you you want to, it's all right to have a low place, but if you have a high place right there, oh, you're gonna have some restrictions. So I'm gonna go right around there and you know check it all the way around because it did have that and I don't know how that got there I'll probably move them around I'm sure but now it's a good it's it's good and free and 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 to to show you where that goes out here while we can look at it on the workbench the uh, then this thing goes up and down that's the way that works this is a one piece one piece uh, long that's the long rod the long governor rod is the way they refer to that now and this shoe goes on the other end we'll get back there in a little bit but this is all of the parts of the governor this is a three-piece unit the short arm lock nut and the bottom part and then this this governor the throttle plate itself and it's sometimes referred to as a throttle and but it's 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 it restricts the intake to airflow hence throttle governor the and this this that short arm goes right there and what you want to do is this this the to to line those up the the this one and this one should be in a same plane like this it should be perfectly straight up and down so when you put this on here put that on there and then you have a washer here and now this is all of the parts of this of this setup and you got a cotter key goes there and a cotter at the bottom and a cotter to top also the uh, and that's all of the parts and this right here can be slid to and fro because there's no adjustment on it right here at this part that comes out on the head the adjustment is the only adjustment that you're concerned with that this is in a straight line and when that this will be off center right there and when the governor works back there then this will go it will it will do that and there is adjustment right here and I'll give you a number it's 330 seconds 330 seconds uh, okay let's touch on that real quick the adjustment on this governor is when you when you assemble the engine and you leave the springs off of the off of this rear part right here leave these springs loose and then you 
move the governor flyweights to the extreme, meaning that it's open. This right here would be, and, and this arm is already on here in a fixed tight. Everything is bolted down, and this is the last adjustment you're going to make. Okay, and, and you adjusted your flyweights back there, and, and you bring this up to where it bottoms out, where it closes the, the butterfly in there. It's completely closed, and it's against the stop. As far as it go, okay. Looking at the front of that right there, you adjust this. You adjust this nut. Take it loose. Make it longer or shorter until you have three. Three. I'll have to. I'll have to look at it up. It's what three thirty seconds. I think too long. Meaning that this right here will be. Above this, uh, this little eyelet right here will be above this little stick out thing, like that. Okay, when you put that on there, then and put all of this together and lock your lock your lock nut and get everything together. When when your fly weights opens up, when the governor opens up and it pushes this lever upwards, then it can it can completely shut the fuel off. In theory, it would shut the engine down. And but you adjust the flyweights to where it never gets to that point. You've always got some air leakage or or something back there. Uh, we'll do that once we get the engine put together. The the uh, Bailey War engine. We we will go through this again and do it on the engine. Th this is just a. Uh, Ah, to catch up, catch up. Uh, something uh, let's call it homework. But that that felt pretty good that time right there. Okay, with that aside over there, this aside over here, and back to this uh, just one time more. And uh, uh, there's nothing more to be said about this. The uh, the governor, pretty much this would be referred to as the governor itself. If someone was talking about the governor, and uh, let's see, the uh, uh, once you put one of these together, it's pretty much, you know, show and tell. Now, uh, to 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 bring you up to date, that we put this new pin in here, we set that right. It's got no no friction on it, and we got this hole too big. Okay, to set that right, once once I get started bolting the engine together, what I will do is when when I've got the flywheel and this is on the flywheel and the and the, the measurement and everything is correct, and I'll slide this will be bolted to the engine, and I'll slide this up here where that that would normally be right there. I'll slide that up there, but instead of putting it in that hole right here, what I will do is turn it because this this is the oil hole, two of them in the top there. This this stays permanent, and I want the oil hole to be to the rear a little bit. So that's what I will do is turn that right around this way, just a, just a, uh, say a half inch, three yeah half inch, and then. I'll drill a new hole right here, a good sliding fit on this shaft right here, and that way everything will work smoothly again. That, that, that's just too much play to use this hole. If you know, if I just reshaped it, opened it up where it was good, that's just too much play. It needs to be in a more uniform position, and all it will do is move the oil hole to the back just a little bit. It'd be easier to get to even. But that's the way that uh, that I will set that right. Uh, the other option is to uh, weld this up and then drill the hole right exactly where it's at, directly in front of the top. Uh, that, but that's where that goes. The uh, and this right here, the, the the all of the parts to this we've talked about it is, um, and I will say it's not a good idea to remove these springs. There's enough adjustment here to where you can adjust this engine to run zero with the spring still attached. Uh, it's a, it seems to be a popular habit to remove a spring or both of them 
and at that point you you're really not governor you're just going to the extreme and it just sits right there it don't have no option to go to comp to uh, compensate and uh, but you got a spring and a hook spring hook uh, fly ball weight fly ball weight and I will, once I get the flywheel in here on the workbench and I put this together, I will put the spacer washers in here and position these flyweights where that uh, they have equal spacing between the flywheel spokes. And you have a lock a nut and a, a, a pinch nut there and two on here and two lock nuts, two cotter keys, uh, cotter pins. Uh, and that's to the extent of it, that's all of it. The uh, the position that this will be in is on the on this part right here is um, the flat will be directly underneath the, uh, the bolt right there, and then you tighten that up to where it's on the flat part. And and where you put this at will dictate from the front where this slides in and out. That's the reason I could not figure out how many. Usually this is in only in one position. So I don't know. Uh, well, we, we, we'll talk about that later. From here on the east coast of Arkansas, that's about all I can say about these governors. We're going to move on to something else now.